What's up, Drum Camp July 2012 camp mates, campers, camp dudes, I don't know what to call you guys. Uh, miss you guys, miss being at camp. Uh, it's the first time on a drum set in over a month uh, since I left drum camp, actually, sad face. But uh, so Ryan had asked if he could, um, you know, get some input and suggestions, advice for preparing for his jazz band audition. So, Ryan, this is kind of for you. Uh, I had written out a couple suggestions for you, but I thought it might be helpful if I actually played a couple of them for you. So, taking Ted Reed's Syncopation, you're going to read through this, you know, book, all the exercises and stuff in this book, in four different ways to help prepare for your jazz jazz band audition. The first way is going to be on the kick drum against the standard jazz ride beat, right? And then the second way is going to be on the snare drum against the standard jazz beat. And you know, once you kind of get those down and you start to feel comfortable with those, then you're going to want to go to, to the third and fourth way of reading through this material. So if you take a look here at the actual page, you're going to see that the notes aren't necessarily written out the way that you would normally see eighth notes and quarter notes written out. They're kind of written out in such a way to indicate short notes versus long notes and you can see all the short notes are indicated as eighth notes and all of the long notes are indicated as quarter notes. So what you can do is you can read all of the short notes on the snare drum and then you can read all of the long notes on the kick drum. And then for the fourth way, you can just flip that around. Short notes on the kick drum, long notes on the snare drum. So I'll play through all these variations for you so you can see what it sounds like. And the reason why I think that this is going to be helpful for you is because it'll give you the ability to read through the chart and to pick up some of those hits. And I think that that's what's most important. Maybe you won't be able to set them up yet. Maybe you won't feel confident, you know, giving a fill before the hit. But if you can read the chart, you can read the hits and get them, comp them either on the snare or the kick then that's going to show that you understand the chart and you can, you know, pick it up from there. So, uh, play through these. Hope these are helpful and uh, good luck on your audition, man. I think you're going to kill it. Alrighty, man. See ya. Same thing, just on the snare drum. Um, exercise two. Short notes on the kick drum, long notes on the snare drum. Number three, here we go. like that. 